Hi there, I'm just going to give you a brief overview of uh, the myheatpump.com. This is the online monitoring for Harnitech heat pumps. So as we can see here, there's a list of some of the systems that we have online. And at the right hand side, these are all the settings that you can look at and change should you require it. So the first one is an overview of the system. So you can see, here's a picture of the fan unit. It's telling you the ambient temperature at the fan unit. We have all the pressures that are going on the refrigerant side within the system and also the primary flow and return temperatures. This unit is currently in standby as you can see at the top here and down the left hand side we have all the relevant temperatures to do with the hot water temperature, the buffer temperature and flow and return temperature on the heating side. The next available option is looking at the parameters of how that heat pump's been running so you can optimise this system should you require it. So we can look at cooling and heating water temperature, sanitary hot water temperature and as an example if there's a third party room stat uh, installed on this system you can also look if that has permanently been running and if it's just to do with the programming of that. If we look at those it brings up exactly how that system's been running. It gives you a key at the top so you know exactly what you're looking at. The next available option is another overview of the system. So here we can, again we can see all the temperatures and the operation of the system, whether the outdoor unit's currently working. It also tells you this at the top. As you can see it's still in standby. And should you be using this as a hybrid system or should you have uh, an immersion heater hooked up to it, you can set all these parameters down here. The next available option, which is where you can really get into, into the settings of the system, as you can see here, anything you can do physically on the interface of the heat pump, you can do from myheatpump.com. So we have quick settings, so as an example, if somebody's played around with the heat pump interface and adjusted the hot water temperature, from the comfort of your office or your own home, you can adjust this accordingly. As well as that, you can look at the weather compensation, so you can set all the required temperatures down here. It gives you full control of that system without having to send an engineer to sign. Finally, along here, you can see the exclamation. Should one of your systems have a failure or an error, uh, this will send you an email as an alert it will tell you what the error code is and actually what the problem is. So rather than sending an engineer to site, you could possibly fix this uh, failure uh, using the online monitoring or alternatively, if something has broken down or a spare part is required, you send into an engineer to site with the required piece.